Windows operating system ever stopped you from getting into Android development like custom ROM development or custom kernel development? Well, this won't be a barrier anymore. <laughs> I don't know how many of you know about this but the Windows 10 latest update has included a Linux bash on Ubuntu for Windows. And at first I thought it would be buggy and quite quite hopeless to be frank. But it gets the job done. But keep that in mind that you can't directly make changes to the files using the file explorer. I mean you can view them but you can't make changes to them. If you change any of those files those changes won't be visible in the bash. But if you really want to make any changes, you can easily do them using the terminal. As you can see here, we have created this new YOLO folder on the root directory which we are browsing right now. If you check it on terminal now, you won't be able to find that file because we created it on explorer. But you can make directory directly from the terminal and it will be visible here. Now all the links on how to install bash or how to activate bash on windows, I'll link them down in the description below. Other than that, trust me, there's nothing different. You just install all your required files just as you do on your Linux system. In this way, you can easily follow any of the guide you want. And now, if you hate Windows 10, you don't want to switch to Windows 10 or there are any other problems, you always have the sweet option of VirtualBox. Now, if you have any doubts or any comments or any suggestions or anything, you can just drop them down in the comment section below. I hope you found this video interesting and informative. So cheers and good luck with that and I'll see you guys in the next one.